Let's get you now to San Jose tonight, where a newly released video shows the moment a mother broke her ankle after Santa Clara cops busted down her door. The city just awarded her a whopping $7 million. Night beats Maria Medina live tonight at the Santa Clara Police Department with what the chief's been saying. Maria? Well, Veronica, this all began when that woman's teen was identified as an arson suspect. Well, now the police chief is speaking out, saying the video you're about to see is missing a crucial part and a warning to viewers it may be disturbing to some. No, you are not allowed to come in this house. Yes! Yeah, Get your hands off me! It's the injury that Daniel Burfine says left her with a permanent debilitating nerve condition. It's broke! Look at it! It's broke! Oh my God! Oh my God! But the Santa Clara police chief is standing by his officers, insisting they did nothing wrong. I'm extremely disappointed in the city's outside insurance company for settling. We're going to arrest your daughter for on-view charges. The 12-minute video released by Burfine's attorney begins with an officer warning her to step away from the door as she refuses to open it because officers didn't have a warrant. So could you please move back? It's not clear by the video what causes Burfine to fall. Her attorney says officers threw her down, but the chief says that claim is false. My officers used minimal amount of force and just guided her back to the other officer. She slipped on the or tripped on the porch. What's more, the chief says there's a crucial part of the video that's missing. And it was conveniently stopped right at the point where she admitted that it was an accident. But the city settled with Burfine to the tune of $6.7 million. Her daughter later convicted for the arson at Santa Clara High. <laughs> <laughs> they plan to speak out tomorrow, but the chief is speaking out now, claiming they're not telling the entire story. And I think the court's decision would found that my officers acted in good faith, within policy and within law. So, Maria, the woman says that she refused to open the door because police didn't even have a warrant. So, did the chief mention anything about why there wasn't a warrant in this case? Yeah, you know, Veronica, the chief says his officers used an exception that allows them onto private property without a warrant. It's called a fresh or hot pursuit. Uh, it's typically used when a suspect actually flees from the cops and hides onto private property. But Burfine's attorney points out that the suspect was just 15 years old and this, uh, this crime was a week old.